And tonight, the Omicron variant has officially become the dominant version of COVID-19 here in the U.S. According to the CDC, the variant makes up about 73% of new infections in America reported in the last week. It's nearly a six-fold increase. Delta had been the dominant variant in the U.S. since June. Health officials continue to tell Americans booster shots are the best way to protect yourself from Omicron. And tonight, there's new data that shows Moderna's booster is effective against the variant. The company said lab tests showed Omicron neutralizing antibodies were low after two doses of its jab by 29 days after a booster dose. They increased about 37-fold. The company is also working on an Omicron-specific booster. Clinical trials could begin early next year. With the CDC recommending both the Pfizer and Moderna boosters, some Americans are wondering, is one mRNA shot better than the other? Tonight, Michael Tang, who is the associate dean for USF's College of Medicine, gives us a sharper insight about which vaccine is best for you. First question, if eligible, when should you get a booster shot? This is the time. Michael Tang says that because of the holidays. Snowbirds coming down from the north. If Omicron is going to spread, this is when it's really going to spread. If you decide to get one, which is better, Moderna or Pfizer? Nothing significant in between the two of them. Pfizer or, or Moderna, it doesn't really matter. But what are the differences between the Moderna and the Pfizer boosters? The vaccine doses are a little bit different. Moderna, for example, is studying two different doses. The normal booster dose at 50 micrograms and then the, the normal regular dose at 100 micrograms. Pfizer's booster has a lower dose. The Pfizer dose is a little bit less, 30 micrograms. It's still gonna boost. Tang says despite the doses, they serve the same purpose, protecting you. Don't wait to figure out whether you want Pfizer or, or Moderna. If you're offered one or the other, just get that one. Let's say your original vaccine was Moderna. Tang says it's safe to get Pfizer's booster. You can mix and match. Just remember, once you get boosted, the vaccine takes time to build antibodies. And after you get the booster, it takes 10 to 14 days for your immune system to really build up antibodies. That brings us back to why my first question was really important. Tang says now is the time to get boosted because Omicron may not be spreading in your city, but Tang says that will likely change. Well, we've been learning the last few weeks how quickly this thing spreads. In terms of side effects from both booster shots, Dr. Tang says people who receive Moderna had slightly more side effects because it's giving you a little bit more in terms of dosage, but the difference is very small. Tomorrow, President Joe Biden is expected to speak to the country specifically about Omicron. He will stream his address on 10tampabay.com.